What's going on, everyone? Juice Bags here, and welcome back to a little Don't Starve Shipwrecked. Now, um, I'm ready to take the journey. As you see, I've uh, I've gotten myself rebuilt a little bit. I've got some more food squared away. I've got uh, another pirate hat and another boat repair kit. And I'm ready to take that long journey down to the X marks the spot. Now, an important recipe that I uh, didn't realize was so easy was three seaweed and a monster meat give you meatballs. How awesome. I mean, come on. Let's see, we're gonna go... Hmm, what do we want to do here? Let's just go with a stick. A twig and just get another fish stick there. I'll leave the rest of that stuff in the fridge. Um, this should be more than enough food to come with me. The meatballs will help out quite a bit with the hunger and of course the surf and turf will help with the, the eating. Now, um, I want to take... I want to be able to make another anti-venom if need be on the road. So I need two coral. I should just, uh, I wish I had the seaweed on me. Let's see, let's just, let's just take the two coral. And... Let's see, I'll leave... I'll leave these boards behind. And what else was it? Two coral, the venom sac or venom gland, and three seaweed, which I'm going to have to collect some more more seaweed on the road. Let me go ahead and grab that, uh, that venom sac, too. And where do we want to put that? I guess uh, we don't really need all that wood. I'll leave a little bit there. Now I got the boat repair kit. I also want to make another sail before I get out of here. And let's see, what did I need for that? I know I need some snakeskin. You know what, let me dump some of this stuff off on the boat. As it is uh, starting to get quite the full inventory here. Gonna leave those twigs. Wish I had that seaweed. So let's see, the boat repair kit needs to stay on the boat. I, I should make some sort of a lamp as well. Then I also wanted to bring... I want the stuff to make another boat repair kit. Let's throw that coral in there and that gland. Yeah, you know what, I'll call it good at that. Now I definitely need another sail as well. And do I want to bring my umbrella? Hell, I might even bring my umbrella. I'm going to leave it first light, that's for certain. Let's, uh, let's grab these fresh limpets here. Yeah, yeah, I'm wet, I know. Once I get back over here, get a fire built, I will very quickly remedy that. Let's see, let's grab some of these logs. Let's just throw a bunch of them in the fire there so we don't have to worry about that. I'm still going to get wet there, huh? Alright, so let me see. Do, I, I'm pretty sure I have another... Let's get that snakeskin hat on first. But I, I really thought I made... There it is. I was going to say, I, I really thought I made another umbrella. Let's see, we'll get that umbrella on. And that's going to dry me right out. No problems at all. Now, what else do I need for the road? I got a spare pirate hat. Let me get these limpets back in here. I don't think I have an... Or I do have another monster meat. So we'll cook up... Cook up one more surf and turf to take with me. I'm just going to leave these fish sticks and hope they don't spoil. Four meatballs and two surf and turf should be more than enough combined with uh, the seaweed and berries and whatever else I find as I'm traveling. But let's look. Let's look at that sail. So I need two rope. Um, let's get a couple of rope. And I got some snake skin somewhere. There it is. And there's a sail. 
So I've got an, an additional sail to take with me on the road. Let's see, what do we want to drop? We want to drop the snake skin. Gonna combine those stacks and just burn up these four logs to make it through the night. What a waste. I'm a log waster. That doesn't leave me very many free inventory slots. As, um, you know, I'm hoping to find the fat loot. Now, I did finally, I, I made another spear. I think I actually did that last episode. I put the subsidian spear up as I don't want to be having any more issues burning shit down. That uh, did not necessarily go as intended. That's for certain. So you don't have anything else in here close to spoilage? I think the meatballs are actually the lowest. Because I definitely want to start the day fresh. See, I got two hammers. I don't need to take two hammers. Let me leave one here. And I've got seven muscle sticks now. I'm going to just try to place those relatively close, as I don't want to spread them too far off the island. You see, I've got... They, they show up on the mini-map, so it makes a nice marker as well. But uh, I think I'm going to go over to the east a little bit here, see if I see any more mussels. That way I can just lay them around, as that's going to be that no expiration, last resort food, just in case I need it. Yeah, we're doing pretty good here. How am I on twigs? I guess I could grab a few more twigs just to fill that stack out. My grass hasn't regrown yet. Oh yeah, there we go. And what about a boat torch? How do you make those? There it is. Oh, it's just boards and a torch. That's awesome. So let's definitely make a boat torch as well. That's going to be handy. And in fact, do we want to just go ahead and head that way? Let's do it. We've got a long way to go. Should be more than more than enough food for me. And how's the boat doing? It's at 207 of 300, so I don't want to throw a heel on it yet. Let's see if I see any mussels in the immediate vicinity. There's a lobster den. A lot easier, easier to see if you uh, come out here in the daytime, obviously. There we go. Let's see. Any mussels? Good gosh, is there no mussels around here? That's alright. Now, if I take the same way back that I take headed out there... I'm just going to let that torch burn out. And let's see, where did my boat torch go? Yeah, that's going to be nice. Let the boat... Let the, uh... Oops, the regular torch just burn out. Good lord. Alright, now, I, I got a long ways south to go here, huh? Let's just keep on... Keep on trucking here. I want to see what we got in these next X marks the spots. Day 48 now. I got 10 days of monsoon season left before, uh, you know, all hell breaks loose and shit hits the fan. Mm, too many stink rays around there. I don't want to be. I don't want to be going down there with all them stink rays to uh, collect muscles back. So let's just head through some undiscovered territory here. Now I'm down to 173, so I could use a hit from this boat repair kit get me up. Oh, and I immediately hit a wave. How smooth, I tell ya. Just amazing how good I am at this game. <laughs> uh, joking, obviously. A lot of these waves, if you hit them right, you can sail through it. Ooh, there's the bottlenose ballpins. Ballfins. Dolphin, ballfin. Yeah, yeah. I'm not sure exactly what... Uh, how I could utilize those guys, but I'm sure there's a way to do it. I'll be happy if I find, uh, ooh, some more shallow water. Suspicious bubbles. Now, there, there's a whale. I'm not sure how you do it, how you get the whale to come up. Ooh. 
But I know there's, uh, there's some whales going down there. Did I unequip my umbrella, or did I let it... Or no, okay, I unequipped it. I was gonna say, I didn't really let my umbrella burn out, did I? Let's see, we're headed the right direction. Ooh, Jesus, if I could just... Just quit hitting waves. The cargo ship is nice, I, uh, I must say. Having those, uh... What is that? Six, seven, eight, eight, er, one, two, three, four, six more inventory slots. And, uh, of course, the sail, you just, has got its own slot there. You just throw that right in there. Now, let's see, what have we over here? This is too far from home to bother placing a muscle stick here, I think, but I'm going to throw it anyway. Just because if I ever come back down this area and I need food, there's going to be some food right there. And if I keep headed south here, there was more muscles. So let me just go ahead and load it up. When I get back up, I'll pull one of those uh, muscle sticks that I've had in the ocean for a while to show you guys exactly what's up with the muscle situation. Plant another one here. Oops. Plant the stick. Don't drop the stick. What the hell? Now I got that boat torch now, so I'm not uh, too concerned about the darkness here. And of course, having the sail, you can just hold a torch as well, which is kind of nice. Lots more seaweed to be had here. The seaweed's going to be providing uh, a bit of my sustenance as we go. Let's see what we got in this reef. No, uh, no yarktopus kicking it anywhere, huh? Let's see, let's look up in here. Looks like that was it. Yeah. Not much to that reef, huh? Not much to it at all. Some more seaweed, though. Grab it while I can. I know the island's just right there, so I'm not too concerned about making it ashore in a uh, proper time. Let's see, let's drop another muscle stick here. Three of them left. But here is my X marks the spots islands. We got limpets, we got all kinds of good stuff. My meatballs are actually uh, starting to starting to get up there a little bit on the spoil factor. Well, there's the first one right there. So let's go ahead and uh, let's get a campfire down. Uh-oh. We got hounds. It should, I lost Abigail again. I don't know how I keep losing Abigail. Oops. Oh, right, there we go, and there's Abigail back, thank goodness. Alright, and let's get some armor on, and I forgot to equip a damn weapon again. <laughs> God, I just constantly forget that. I'm just going to let Abigail do all the dirty work here, and I am going to run around and try to avoid getting my ass handed to me here by these hounds. I can't believe I forgot to equip that damn weapon again. Oops. Yeah, I've got lots of monster meat here. And yeah, my sanity dropped, so... One goes... Oh, god dang mosquito, too. Mm. Now the mosquitoes will let you chase them. Sometimes they can be a little irritating to uh, get a hold of. And the mosquitoes will poison you as well, so you want to make sure that you're you're good. <laughs> I'm going to have to eat just to get my sanity up a little, unfortunately. And did I pick everything up off the ground? I believe I did. So let's get back over and see. Well, first let's... Uh... Where's my shovel? There it is. Let's see what we got in this bad boy. Not a whole lot of... Um... Not a whole lot of inventory slots left. There we go. 
Nice. I got the Tholosite set. Awesome, awesome, awesome. So this spear is going to go away. And this Tholosite club is going to be my new weapon of choice. And that's badass. See, the Tholosite crown. Will that help my insanity? I don't know. We'll have to see. Thulocyte suit, that's uh, that's some badass armor. You know what, I'm going to get rid of these limpets just to free up another spot. See, I don't, I kind of don't want to waste my, my crown. Oh, god dang it. Good thing I brought my poison shit with me. Dang. Let's get rid of these meatballs, and I'm going to have to get up to the boat and make an anti-venom here. Did I just lose at her now? I was gonna say. Did Abigail just die there? But no, she's good. So, let's see. To make the anti-venom... See, I need the two coral and the one sack. So let's do this. And let's just throw the full of sight in the boat for now. And then that's going to allow me to make an anti-venom. Now I'm going to have to stay on the move here. And I'm going to have to pay attention now that we're in this season. Because I could end up getting poisoned over and over and over and over again. And, uh, you know, needless to say, that's less than ideal. God dang. Go get her, Abigail. Get the damn skeeter. Damn mosquitoes all over the place. See, let's free up a little bit more bag space. And I'm not certain if I need this stuff. And I believe I can get two boards. Boy, that's a fat mosquito, huh? Ooh. If I hammer this chest, I believe I can get two boards out of it. Yeah, very nice. Alright, and the other X marks the spot is right down here. So let's see what's in this one. I got that. That's awesome. I got that full of sight set. Because that's like... Oh, nice. That's like endgame armor. I got the all the gold goodies now. So that'll be easy. I'll just drop... Let's see. Drop those two. I got a gold shovel too. Now who's a badass? Let me tell you. <laughs> awesome. See, so let's grab all the gold stuff, and then I'll hammer this chest as well. That's pretty kick-ass. Not enough room for anything else. I'll, I'll just end up burning that board tonight. But I can explore this island a little bit. At least get it mapped out, as I, I have no intention to head it back home right away, because uh, there's a good chance that my crock pot and everything is flooded and going to be completely unusable. And I still got, what, I got a lot of time left. In fact, I should probably set up another little base camp down here. Let's see, let's cook this limpet up. And just eat it. And I'm going to make a chest over here to dump some of this stuff in. And I'm not going to put any of my good shit in there. Damn, another mosquito. Get that full sight club on him. I'm gonna have to. Where you go? There he is. All right, now those that little dealy, the little yellow mosquito sack will throw a little heal on you, which is nice. Let's see. What do we want to drop off in the chest? Nothing really. Absolutely nothing. But I gotta put something in there. So let's see. Let's get a fire pit built. That way we're good there. And then I can throw uh, some more stuff in the cargo, the cargo boat spots here. Let's see. I should have open spot. No, not yet. Well, actually, I can open up a spot there by healing the boat to full, and at least get rid of those. Or do I want to put that full like crown in there? Let's see, I got 40 grass. 
Let's get that in there. I'll probably end up using the grass more frequently. Yeah, we'll call it good. So let's get on back down here. Now, since I'm so far away from uh, from the winter season, I don't really have to worry about the wind, so I'm not going to bother making a chimney down here. But, you know, eventually I would like to get another science station or something going here. Let's get my backpack back on before I go and forget it and do something silly. And pretty awesome. Uh, the opulent luxury. I got the opulent pickaxe, the luxury axe, and the regal shovel. How amazing. Now, how are we doing on food? I'm good on food. My sanity's dropping a little bit, but nothing uh, some seashells couldn't take care of. There's uh, there's some limpets down here, huh? And as you see, the massive flooding coming in. The seashells are actually all dug up now, and that's kind of crappy. Let's get my sanity on the rise again here. Let's see, we had a lot of grass to get rid of, right? Yeah, sure do. Dump that in there. I'm gonna keep the keep the gems, of course. Maybe cook up these limpets. Do I have seaweed too? Or did I or I put the seaweed in the chest? Let's see, I'm gonna cook up the seaweed as the limpets are probably gonna last a little bit longer. Damn mosquito. Now come on, the fire should keep the damn mosquito away. <laughs> of course it doesn't work that way, but boy, that would be nice. And you switch back to the hat. You know what, I've got, uh, I don't know why I'm even concerned here. I've got that boat torch. Pretty stoked to have a, a Thulazite club now. Yeah, that's going to do, uh, you know, that's going to do a decent amount of damage. And we're heading into absolute darkness. So why don't we go ahead and call it good here. I got two more uh, X marks the spots knocked out of the way with a really nice chest in one of them. Uh, so that's just awesome. Got no complaints there. So thanks again for watching. Click that like button. Please subscribe to the channel. We're at day 49. We're getting ready to start day 50. Got nine days left of monsoon season before the summer comes. So uh, the fun is just beginning. Thanks again. I'll see you soon.